retinal detachment just has to do with having a tear or a hole in the retina and fluid going through that and blistering the retina off. And if you can imagine a swimming pool or for Iowa a stock tank that has a liner in it, if you got water between the liner and the wall of the tank or pool, that would be a retinal detachment. People with a retinal detachment may notice that they have floaters, uh, they might notice flashing of light, and they would notice that they might have loss of peripheral vision, which some people describe as a veil or a curtain. If they have that, that symptom, they should call the Wolf Eye Clinic immediately and seek treatment. Uh, without prompt care, it can lead to blindness. When it starts in the beginning, often we can fix it with just a laser procedure without, without doing actual surgery. There can be another uh, procedure in clinic where we put a bubble inside the eye. Ultimately, sometimes it requires surgery where we go to the operating room and fix it with uh, removing the gel in the eye, replace, putting the retina back in place, and then putting gas inside the eye. And sometimes there are combinations of these operations where patients will have a band put around their eye and have a vitrectomy, an operation to remove the gel, and it will be filled with a bubble. So it depends a lot on the presenting circumstances. Here at the Wolf Clinic, we're uh, lucky that we have a great facility, a great team, and specialized physicians to deal with uh, both simple and complicated rental detachments. Surgery often is uh, successful, but um, uh, it is urgent, and uh, if any of those symptoms occur, uh, please see your eye doctor. Do not delay.